Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, today is the day. Today, the game is finally launched. Total War Warhammer 3. And yeah, we just watched that watch in China. Straightforward to go into play. And today we're gonna play some Total Warhammer 3 campaign walkthrough. The tome of fate drew me north to find out why. And this is a campaign intro. To a distant fortress steeped in blood. A battle was do, 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 do. So long over. So um, yeah, we're not gonna play the prologue because well, it's we know how to play the games already. But if you want to understand what's happening before the main campaign, well, you should play the prologue because it's kind of interesting to be honest. It's kind of interesting to be honest. They told of Urson, the bear god of Kislev. Lost in dark. And uh, I'll, I'll, I'll try to keep the, the, the time to 24 minutes around. From the past, to make sure that it, it is not got too overwhelming for our episode. Sword of Eels, boys! Executioner. The traitor. Yeah, this guy's a traitor. Forsaken pierced Urson's heart. And so the bear god roared. Mm hmm. The tide that broke the world. Yep. Spirits, where lies Urson? By the way, uh, the guy who shot Urson is actually the guy who's gonna play as the Demon Prince, but we're not gonna play him for now because we're not gonna play Demon Prince for this series. But instead, I will show you where we're gonna play. What shadow? A demon's? A master of the dark. Master of the dark. Belacor. I knew who shackled the bear. The first demon prince Belacor. of all time. The first demon prince, guys. He is. I think the most famous of all. Like everybody knows who Belacor is, but like they don't know who the other demon prince is. And yet, the power of a dying god. There is no greater prize. A mere drop of Urson's blood. You do know that. Great All you have to do is just go there already and just ask him if he can give you a blood. Like just one drop. It's kind of it's not big of a deal, you know, to be honest. I'm pretty sure he will understand it. I think Forge of Soul, if I interpret it correctly, is where the soul grinders are made. Roots have been sealed by the maelstrom. There must be a way. This is the way. Ah, the tome unveils a spell to summon a portal. So yeah, uh, you could just ask. He could just ask, I'll be honest, guys. I'll be honest, he could just ask. Knowledge to bargain. No, uh, my uh, prediction uh, actually was kind of not correct. Uh, I don't know if it's that correct. It's not that correct, I don't know. To be honest, I don't really know what's going on in the game. So really, yeah. But my prediction overall... It's not a very, very accurate prediction, but it's not a bad prediction at all. So yeah, so yeah, this is a demon prince. This is guy who actually shot. Um, this is he is actually the one who shot um, Urson actually. But uh, yeah, we're not gonna play as him today. We're gonna play as Sin, Changer of the Ways. Also, it's also apparently favorite number nine for some reason. I don't know why. He, he favorite number seven, he favorite number six, he favorite number eight. We all know the eight foot pass. And think you probably favorite nine, but uh yeah. So we're gonna play as Karis Fate Weaver, the Oracle apparently of Sinch. And also, yeah. He has two head. Interestingly enough, he is the only He is the only uh bird in the world I don't I don't I'm afraid of. I'm not afraid of. And we're gonna play as normal and normal as always how we began and uh, yeah, so the faction effect is that the prediction accuracy plus 100% I guess this is how you're gonna play it. Oh, oh sure later. And we have battle reinforcement time minus 50% which means our other people, our other army reinforcements can come earlier than the enemy opponent's one. And also have hero action success chance plus 15% which is pretty nice, and the uh, lore effect can unlock unique items that can be used to customize Carol's spell selection, which is pretty good. Uh, hero success late 
TLO, enemy TLO success chance minus 50%, pretty nice. And MBH defense plus 50 because he can see the past and the future, so he can see everything. And let's begin the campaign. With our further ado. And uh, we're gonna watch a very cool cutscenes. Everything Total Warhammer 3 is pretty mature, definitely. Like, everything, like the cutscenes, the gameplay, and also because you have creators tested already, so technically you don't have that much of an issue, supposedly. But uh, yeah, let's see how it goes, how's it gonna go. Obviously, I'm a huge fan of Zinge. I think everybody is actually a fan of Zinge, to be honest, because they're just so cool. Especially if you play 40k, you know that the Legion that Zinge infected is the Thousand Sun, who is also pretty cool. The Eyes of the Bear. Dark. It's kind of disgusting. Refuge of Kairos, Fateweaver. Why is it a refuge? Of all the silver, silver tower. So we're gonna spend like the six and ten minutes to just like watch the campaign intro around. So yeah, if you don't want to watch it, you can skip it to around seven minutes or eight minutes maybe. I told him a person held captive in the Forge of Souls, but he dismissed my wisdom. We already know no, that of course blood. For I see the past, and, and I see the future. But you are blind to the, the present. present. You did not see the I'm not blind to the present, I'm blind to the present. I can never mind. The Tome of Fates holds the answer. The spell we search for. Kill him, brother. Take it. Let me just change a little bit, Yuri Mo. To my soul. We can unpick it. No, let him serve us for one of good blood. So I suppose the yellow I see the future. Use their power to view the present. The sight of a god, the past, present, and future. All will be ours. I'm wondering, it, will he go a third head after he gets the eye? Will he do that? Because what he's gonna put the eyes just on his palm or something? Our goal is the eyes of the god. Yeah, but I'm questioning how is he gonna like put a third eye, fourth eye, third, the third pair of eye on? Is he gonna just put on a third head? I guess that's how I mean, it works. So for those who doesn't know, in case you don't have that much of knowledge, so the Deceiver, I believe, is the first Lord of Change in the first Warhammer. Now, obviously, if you play the Mortal Empire, you can also say in Mortal Empire, but I think, yeah. So basically, it's that bird. Do you remember birds, guys? Like on his shoulder, that's the bird actually. That's actually, I think, the Lord of Change, basically. But yeah. He is the pawn of the sea because he is actually under control, actually. Now, my prediction for the chaos, um, basically, is I thought, uh, I honestly thought, what will happen is that we're just gonna invade the world while the world is gonna invade the chaos realm. In some degrees, it's kinda true. The settlements further along but uh yeah so they basically have the same goals basically except the demons want to technically kill urzen while the while the others try to save him that's the only defense there is and infiltrated the dragon empire take advantage and invade before the bastion's powerful guardian can plug the gap once within Cathay, you and your minions can tear it apart. But that is just one destiny open to you. To the south are many scattered tribes. Yeah, um, no so a lot of things to be explained. Your influence across the chaos wastes. And in the east, the ogre kingdoms are entrenched in their... Oh, yes. Oh, grace, my lord. They're everywhere now. Ha! To teleport will allow you to scour the mountains of their hunger. So one of the Zinch abilities is to teleport, which is obviously very cool. 
It is your will that will weave them into a power base that shall take us into the realm of chaos and to the dying god. Let us begin. Well say, my friend. Let's begin. So the Servant of Things will automatically wage war on any non-chaos faction they encounter. Now this uh, applies to every chaos chaos faction, by the way. And uh, we have from Chaos Cult. Where's one thing is... Changing of ways. Oh, and these are this here. You must first... So basically it's just... You darkness for so Alright, so let's just begin. And I will showcase what you need to have. So we're gonna play the first battle. So I played a bit Chaos Fit we were before, so like he's not easy to play. Now he has a kind of like compared to the other flash chain, he has like a harder starting position I would say because well you are near the your mortal enemy already, so like yeah. Yishimai. Yishimai. Alright. Well you look at that. Dude, this guy is looking crazy. Flamer is one of my favorite units because it is good. The Soul Grinder. The best, one of the best units. And we have the Exotic Pink Chorus and we have Blue Horrors. Yes, 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 yes. And we also have the Bird in the Air. The Bird in the Air. Lord of Change himself. The Oracle of Change. Karas Fate Weaver. Alright, let's just go back go out from the cinematic world. Now we're gonna go do is establish a fire line. Work as one. Carol's free week was going up there and yeah. The forces of Cathay are most effective when fighting in an ordered formation. Be wary of disrupting them and breaking the harmony on which their fighting strength depends. Harmony. Wait, how does that work? So yeah, always one of the Grand Cassis um, faction thing is the uh, harmony. Alright. We went there. Okay, that's not harmonized. So spellcaster is always one of the some of the strongest thing of all time. Our who is gonna charge back? We come out. So all the zinc units has barriers, aka protections, to protect them from well, damage. Obviously, uh, we cannot use that yet. Oh, this is a good one. Now this, my friend, this is a good one. So yeah, so his second ability is very good against lords and uh, single and I would say most likely single, mostly single entities. And then yeah, how they get hurt. So I feel take a little bit damage, but it's fine.
I guess our thing's also dealing damage to us, I guess. Let's just clean them up a little bit so we don't have to fight them anymore. Good, we're done. This is a victory. Nice. So yeah, so this unit is pretty powerful. We see Soul Burners doing a lot of kills, getting a lot of kills, and also Carol's Speed we were getting a lot of kills. Now this is one of the easiest battles as things you can play as. Now usually, well, people will like just not even get any damage, but uh, yeah, we're different. Do -do -do -do. So we're not gonna replenish because we don't really do matter. So let's play. Let's 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 add some wind of magic reserve. Okay, 150, nice, let's go. And we obviously have a lot of money. Summon more demons to your cause, great oracle. You will need a large host of puppets for the wars to come. Now, Zinch requires a lot of melee units because they are kind of weak to protect. So let's add, let's, let's get some four seconds and also let's, let's increase to get some Exalted pink slow pink one. Review of Force Rebellion. This is actually So what I'm aiming for is this. So what I'm gonna do is go let's do growth first. So I think he has a lot of stuff. While others rely solely. Capture and occupy. What if we transfer settlements? We can't. It requires 400. Oh, never mind. So we get this. Nice. Nice. Not every settlement requires labyrinthine skills. Oh, by the way, let's use up ownership. Let's take a look. What's action. your trait? You oh, did, did, did they remove the trait? Presents. Oh, did they remove the trait? No, oh, tactician. Okay, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. Okay, not too bad. Not too bad. We don't have to. Good thing is, we don't have to fight that one anymore. So what do we have here? Uh, income from all buildings. We could do that, or I would say, hmm, let's go for growth. We always let's just get some pink horse, blue horse. No right. This there. What do we need actually right now? So there are 100. So let's take a look at diplomacy. Now diplomacy also has some changes to it. Oh, I'm not gonna give you that. Are you? So my existence is part of the chip. I'm not gonna pay you that much. Are you joking? I'm not gonna pay you that much. This is such a bad deal. It's just a bad deal, guys. So let's take a look at corn. Is anybody coming yet? Nope. Oh well. So we need some melee units, obviously. So we basically, uh, what I want to do is secure the first province we can get before we do anything else. Nope, it chose not you. Nope. Okay, I'm not gonna pay you that much. Like it's impo I, I'm not. I'm not gonna pay you that much. Okay. No. Uh, no, we can transfer. We cannot transfer. We need to wait for eight turns and uh, diplomacy. We don't magic manipulation. We can't manipulate anything yet. And uh, wait for last turn. 
Yes. Do we get the money back? Oh, we do. Let's get some extra money. A little bit, but it's not. But it's good. Okay, so we recruit a little bit. The shadow of the Raven God must fall across these lands. Spread the corrupting influence of Tinch far beyond your borders. So it's spreading. Is the life blood. Yeah, we're getting money. That's. Okay, so they have a lot of Marauder units, so what we're going to do is... Yeah, they have a lot of Marauder units. But we have... So we have Dinch, we are good with magic. So a lot of things has changed from Warhammer 2 to Warhammer 3, so we need to adapt to the changes too. So we're going to send our full Seeker in the front and uh, our Runyon in the back, so it can be protected. They do have some full seeking units too, actually, funny enough. So yeah, so full seeking are basically, I guess they just... Chaos... Night, nah, Chaos Fighters, right? I guess, maybe? Okay, so, ooh, this is very, ooh... Crash... Okay! Let's take a look. Let's just, let's take a look, at, look at these guys. Let's just let's just take a look. Ah, oh, yes, those corrupted bodies. I love it. They are so cool, actually. They are actually pretty cool, I'll be honest. Send, I'm gonna send these two guys to the back. These are gonna be my back assault units. So most of the first are ready to storm the defenses, yet I advise caution. You face an entrenched enemy. What the heck? Why is it? No, no. Okay, so we are taking obviously we have advantage right now because we Begin our assault now. On the way. My wings spread. Are you guys winning? Flying secure? Okay, I'd like to hear that. Good, you co you're coming together will be my way to achieve victory. That's actually pretty good, okay? I like you guys concentrate more. Because it'll be good. You know what? We could. Yeah. 
obviously this magic also damage our troops as well. Okay, you guys can start with L. Okay. All of them are there. Jesus. All of them. That's a very uh, that's good magic. That's good magic there. Because, uh, because these guys just run over there, so yeah. Okay, our first second is not, not damaging, being damaged too much, but it's fine. Got some good magic again, nice, well done, nice. That's good, that's good, that's not too bad. Not too bad. You guys pull out, pull out, pull out, pull out, your advantage has been gone. How would you on the other side? These four seconds are not to be underestimated. Everybody's going down. Are we winning? Yes, we are. Go yeah, go yeah, go yeah, go yeah. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay, it's going along. Okay, pull up, 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 pull up,
We might have to refight this one if we lose Soul Grinder. Like we may have to refight this one maybe. I still wonder if these guys are even fire. Like I don't think they're even doing anything right now. And how are you guys? What is going on? Oh, this battle just went wrong for so much degrees. Bruh. I didn't recruit this much print color for them to do nothing. He got 145 already, Jesus. Okay, he now killed you. Oh my god. I'm back there and Mystic. Bro, this is getting to nowhere. Oh well. Okay, they drop him around finally. Are they even defense mode? Oh, they're not in defense. That explain why now, fudge. Yep, I made a mistake. Honestly, I made a stupid mistake. No, get out of Oh thank god he's Yes, they're down. Alright, we're winning. Oh fine, this is over. You die. Oh god, I forgot tower. Yeah, the new system. Yeah, the, the new tower stuff. So annoying. It's just so annoying. My Car Carol is dying. Bruh, if you died, I would be so much sadder now. Add you guys to defense? Yes, you guys are in defense, thank god. It will be much disastrous. He's almost dead. Yeah, we have to have a rematch on this one. We have to take a rematch on this one. Like, yeah. Because this is taking longer should it be and we lose more units than we're supposed to be. So yeah, that's not good. I thought Kairos was almost dead by the way, guys. Kairos was almost, almost dead. Can you believe it? And wow. No, come back, come back, come back, come back. Oh my god. This is just so annoying to so much levels. To be honest, playing convention Total War having to too much that I like, like, like kinda kinda like, kinda kinda not like, able to adapt to the new situation. Yeah, this is a thing too long than it's supposed to be. Take it back, take it back. Oh wow. Wait, can I let it play? Yeah, no, I don't think I can. Yeah, we're gonna take a rematch of this one. Like we can win this one, but like we have to take a rematch. This is taking this is taking too long. Yeah, no. Rematch. 
Yeah, we're taking a rematch. This is so bad, actually. So much level. Yeah, we might have to take this to an hour. Oh, um, yeah. Made a mistake. You know what, this time? I'm gonna allocate my troops. Yeah, attacking ones that is too much. It's not useful, the problem is. Like... Now, obviously, this... This is a lot, th that is a lot of troops. Like, honestly, it is a lot of troops, but like... I think we can do better. I think we can do better than that. I think one advantage they got is that it's a very short alleyway. We can't even do it. Yeah, I have to get to new. I, I have to. I have to really, really like get used to this new control because, like, yeah. Defenses, yet I advise caution. You face an entrenched enemy that has had time to prepare. Be wary. This tower is annoying me. When you take that tower as soon as possible. That's that tower is so no it's annoying to the sudden to too much such to such a level. Take the great weapons down. You can target a building? Are you serious? Okay, it's fine, it's fine.
All right, let's go. So long, like like it's easy to get out of patience when you play this. Moving out, moving out, moving. Like, and what's more funny is that we are actually always in vintage. We need some reinforcements over there. Okay. What the? Huh? Don't sleep. You see, this is this one as much. Like this is just so much better than the last one. Mm -hmm. What the? Hey, did I cast the wrong way? So most of you are draw to them. How much damage did This is better. Oh, this is so much better, guys. This is so much better. It's so much cleaner, too. I know we lost, it's just a little bit Fury, who I really don't care about. And also that is much faster, as you can see, guys. The boss uh, is also faster. I guess the rematch is like... I think it's like better than like, just like... Instead of just doing little quick save, you can rematch, which is I think it's much better. I think, I guess. Okay, so they're all defeated. Good. I'm going to challenge your lord. So interestingly enough, like every time we use the spell, apparently time just stopped. I don't know if it's me. Okay, let's not let's not quick enough because it's not we would not we don't have we haven't won yet. We still haven't won yet. Okay, you draw store 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 store. Okay, Okay, don't get too distracted, don't get too
pink forest kind of be, is very powerful. Well done, well done, well done. I definitely Siege Battle is so becomes so much more I guess harder in the same time because you have so much defense building that yeah. And especially if you're fighting flying units, like it's it's very disadvantage against you if you are fly if you are flying units. I feel I feel like each video will be longer now with this settlement upgrade, like because the tagging settlements will become harder and also yeah, because before like we we would just always like auto resolve everything, which is kind of easy, but now because you have defensive buildings, the level is kind of higher, so yeah. So I would say, eh? Okay. Oh, I saw with the chariot, chariot. Okay, so Carol's didn't get much kill this time, but uh, it's fine. It's better last time, definitely. Yeah, there's a reason why we have to do that because if we don't, we don't do that, it's definitely much harder. I will say, like, this faction is kind of powerful. Like, I always have trouble like, fighting against these guys. So, we're just gonna go down the logic line. Go. Wow, there's so much level three already. But that's a lot of. I feel like I feel like the leveling is also kind of easier for some reason. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm Bruh, you can't just demand me so much money. Like, you can't. Let's grab that guys, first. Again, just practice. Just some practice. I know I'm, I know you're gonna say, well, being weak guys, no practice. It's just bullying. Okay, I yeah, know, guys. I know what, what you're talking about still. Oh, by the way, it's funny actually. You, now, you, if, now you can actually replenish your single entity now. Like it will, like it will actually heal instead of like just like instead of just like not healing. Like I think this is also a good add-on to be honest. So we're gonna start for a place these blue horror with pink horror. I don't know, I just feel personally just I just need to stronger I think. Some extra P XP for us. I just keep this guy safe. Spells may be overcast to increase their potency, my lord. Yet I advise caution. Channeling so much raw magic at once brings the risk of disaster. Okay, that's... Oh, God. Oh, that's right. I mean, damage dealing, we have shield. Nice. Oh, shit, it's off already! Okay, I, I see what you're talking about, mister. I see what you're talking about. So yeah, so if you miscast, there's a chance to deal damage to yourself, and apparently that happens a lot today. Maybe you're not oracles after all, you know. 
So the pink horse deals more damage than the blue horse. Which I guess, yeah. They have more like rattling guns, I feel like. Now, we are attacking them not because we want to help the Grand Cafe, no, we don't want to help them at all, but because we want to get some XP. Which is more, much more, which more, which matters more than like, which matters more than like just fighting units, I feel like. Because of how yeah, getting XP has definitely got easy. I don't know, part of the reason is because I'm playing on easy difficulty, no, on, on normal difficulty, not easy. Yes, you can see me turning up into normal difficulties. You see, like, just one battle, we, we just get four replenished ready. Like, you see how powerful this is. I'm not gonna... Bruh, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna spend $9,000 just to get you... Ooh, shadow review... That's actually pretty good, actually. The fates cry out for this. Yeah. Allegiance is the lifeblood of Marshall Alliance. Fostering allegiance Ooh. will pay dividends should the need for close call. How do you get an allegiance arise. point? I should not work. Oh, oh, this is oh, this is very interesting, actually. Maybe you can. Oh, this is very interesting. I feel like. Threatening him. <laughs> Am I just threatening him? Can I? Oh no, I don't have enough books. Oh, this is a of only found a fifty turns. Well, all of you take it. Take it. Research rate, gross control. Ooh, from each building. Yeah, really. I want you to upgrade into level two into this. Uh, blue horror, pink horror, resident horror one. Singe, okay, it's for second of Singe, she has Night of Singe, what is... Doom Knight, oh, Chaos Knight of Singe, what do you spawn? Flamers and spawn are better. We have a pretty good income, I would say. A pretty fair income. Nice. 
nice. Wait, they're taking out the walls already? Those stone dragons. Yet it may also serve your ambition for conquest. A pact of non aggression Sheesh. can be a useful tool to bind the hands of your rivals, leaving you free to make war elsewhere. Oh, wait, wait. I know nope. all fates. Whoa! Why do I have so much armies already? Getting some strong units, guys. Well, we don't invade them. Okay, so we're gonna into this. We're gonna into this that. So yeah, okay, and then we're gonna do... Interesting, what should we put here? So... Sheesh! Whoa, why do they have so much armies already? And also, by the way, guys, for those who a rival power desires a change in your mutual relation. That's exactly what I need. Let's upgrade all of our settlements. Okay, we're just gonna finish this battle. If we do well, well, that's good. If we did not do well, well, it's okay, but so yeah. Ooh, we need to finish these guys first. We, okay, so we're gonna take all of our forces to the back. Pretty sure our stuff, we don't really need reinforcements, but well, we can do it. So yeah, that's good. Right. Okay, so there is a little bit of that.
So all the one you're casting spells, it will just give you a few seconds of slow motion, which is also pretty cool. Oh fuck, don't let them escape! They'll <laughs> just run away! We foresaw them doom. Yeah, 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 I know. You see the future, he sees the past. Oh, how did he do that? He actually is alive, actually, wait. Huh. How do we lose people? Yeah, these guys kill a lot of people. That's why I like, prefer use pink horror instead of blue horror. Like, they're much more effective. And they also deal more damage. They are like points and mortar from Skavens. Okay, so there you go, guys. This is the end of the video. If you enjoyed this video, please consider leave a like. If you want to see more video on Total War Hammer 3, please consider subscribe to the channel. Besides that, I will see you guys later. Stay healthy and also stay positive. Goodbye, everybody!